Hey, what's going on everyone? Uh, I wanted to do a product review on, I've had this product for a while and it just didn't cross my mind to do a review on it, but um, I think it's uh, very important and it's always good to be uh, responsible, especially if you're drinking and you definitely should not be drinking and driving for obvious reasons. But in order to uh, check your blood alcohol content prior to driving, so you don't get a DUI and endanger your life and other people. I got this breathalyzer right here years ago. This is, hopefully you can see that. This is the uh, Backtrack uh, 780 breathalyzer right here. And uh, I'm gonna show you, comes in this uh, little nifty pouch right here. And it, screen, it screens for the presence of alcohol and provides a BAC estimate. And I've used it um, a few times. And it uh, requires uh, two AA batteries and it comes with six mouthpieces. And you can buy more if you need more. And it has this case and instruction manual. So let me uh, pull it out for you. So it comes in a little thing like this. And here it is in all its glory right here. It's not too big, um, so it's not bad. And then you put the batteries right here. Let's see if I can show you. Two double A's right there. And to be safe, I like to always keep a couple extra batteries inside here. And then also, it comes with six mouthpieces. And it's just like this. So you got that, and then you just put it in like this. And then what you do is you're just gonna hit the start button, and when you hit the start button, it's gonna have a timer and a countdown. Once that timer is done, you just blow into it. You'll hear it beeping. Actually, let me just show you. Nine. Down to five. There you go. Then it goes beep beep, you heard that, and then it's reading it. Sorry for the glare, and obviously I haven't drank any alcohol and it's .0000. And then that's it, and you could take multiple readings. Um, I, it 100% does work. Um, I do got to go back to work, so I don't want to swig something, but you got to promise me if you try to drink something and test it, it will detect more than .000. And uh, this product is about $120 plus tax on Amazon. Um, I haven't had any problems with it. I looked at some of the recent reviews and I've heard that with this product after about 200 reads, that it malfunctions and then you have to spend like $25 to get it recalibrated and then it still messes up. I haven't had that problem before so I'm not saying that's true or false. I've probably in my lifetime I've probably done this the amount of reads. I've probably done maybe I don't know 20, 25 who knows over the span of like multiple years. So hopefully I don't run into that problem but that's just as a disclaimer. But um, it does come in handy, and you would be amazed that how easy it is to blow a .08. You may feel fine, but unfortunately the law is the law, and I've had times where I felt fine, and I didn't even feel buzzed, and then I would blow a little bit over a .08. I would drink water, I would wait, and then I would blow into it, and as long as I was under, I was good to go. Um, that's just on a little side note. That's just my personal preference. If you do blow a .07, these things can have a plus or minus um, error either way. So I would still be cautious on a .07. I, I would say .06 and below, and then maybe you can drive. And then if a cop does pull you over and he wants to do a, a reading on his own, you can bust yours out and see and, and compare. Now, if the cop pulls you over and you're fine, you're good to go. But if you're at that borderline, you could be like, hey, hold on a second. You know, you can have a backup and show that maybe your tester is, is inaccurate and you can fight that in court. 
So anyway, uh, that is my uh, time for this video. Uh, it's the Backtrack Select once again. Overall, it's a good, it's a good product. Uh, I haven't had any problems with it. Always be safe, don't drink and drive, and uh, that's it. So uh, I'll talk to you uh, later. Uh, subscribe for more uh, health and fitness related videos and workouts, cooking videos, reviews, and some random videos thrown in here and there. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.